What's gravy, baby? You already know who it is, man. It's your boy Trey. Follow the Trey way. I never leave you astray. And I got a quick video for y'all today. If y'all see my last video, y'all saw that I was able to get that free Big Daddy Sapalicious, aka Warren Sap. I was able to get that free fan appreciation player by pretty much doing all those 14 daily objective challenges, completing all the regular challenges or I should say those 14 daily objectives and then completing all the challenges for the fan appreciation and got all those tokens and then I was able to actually get enough of those to get all my fan appreciation free players all the way maxed out and was also able to put enough into that one set to get the free legendary um not not the free legendary but the free 99 overall fan appreciation pack but I just got finished maxing out the field pass right here, the fan appreciation field pass, and we were able to get a legendary fan appreciation variety pack B and D. So I don't know if this varies because it says variety, and usually if it says variety pack, guys, that pretty much means that it could be anything. It can be maybe a coin pack. It can be um, maybe a player pack, or you know, it can be a variety of things so i don't know if all of y'all got what i got but i am actually able to get a second free 99 overall fan appreciation player because of this pack right here so let me know in the comment section were y'all able to get another free 99 overall fan appreciation player for completely maxing out this field pass right here and how i did it you know i went through and i mainly did most of these in challenges you got to make sure you got two fan appreciation players in your lineup um if you go back a few videos ago i had a full guide on how to max this out but essentially you want to get two fan appreciation players in your lineup so that way you can go into challenges or in solo battles and get all of these objectives done okay and then daily objectives as well you know these also gave you all the fan appreciation tokens and also give you the loyalty token to upgrade one of those three players of ron clark plastico burris or joe thomas to a 99 that's what that loyalty token right here was for and this head the head one here i didn't even have to do it didn't even matter i maxed everything out without doing this one so it is possible to max it out without having to do this solo battle head to head 10 wins okay because i've done it and you see all that i've done so the question is trey so out of this variety pack you did get a free 99 another free 99 you're damn right i did baby you know what i'm saying you see right here 99 overall B D fan appreciation fantasy pack like i said let me know if you guys got the same thing after you max out the field pass because it says variety pack maybe ea is dumb maybe they slow maybe they made a mistake and put variety on it maybe it was supposed to be another free one I, I the hell if i know it's ea sports but all i know is i got a second free 99 overall B D fan appreciation fantasy player pack right here and it's the same one as i showed you guys yesterday it's the same pack where you can choose any of the non ltds okay any of these non ltd players you can choose i chose warren sap aka big daddy sapalicious you hear me that's who i chose yesterday so now the question is trey who the hell do we choose today you know as i am i ain't and i already know who i'm choosing bro it's gonna be lincoln goddamn kennedy and you might be like why trey i'm explaining because number one my right tackle right now is lane johnson free lane johnson he's not a raider or a seahawk so he doesn't go towards my theme team and this dude right here gets very good abilities and has very good numbers he might be the best goddamn right tackle in the game if we're being real none of these other guys i need i don't need none of these dudes like will shields is a little tempting but with um his card i think i have um who's my right guard right now i think it's the free zach martin so that's why i don't want to get this guy right here deshaun jackson i mean just for returning kickoffs maybe he would be cool but like why would i choose him just to do that you know what i'm saying i need somebody that's gonna make an impact on my team warren moon hell no i got um what's the dude name patrick my homeboy arian foster don't need him he don't get any team keem neither i'll pass i already got him 
night train do your good in the dark lane man listen this dude right here he actually is not a bad card when you think about it he's not that bad of a card um because you know he's 99 stock and just about all the main like i mean he's okay he's 99 stock everywhere let's get it straight he is 99 stock everywhere but i got richard sherman i got um richard sherman and i got Tariq woolen which both they are bigger and taller you know and they got decent ability slots as well so i mean i i, I don't know bro i don't know i just i just don't see the need for me needing night train lane man even though he may be very glitchy Ed too tall jones i'm good on the d line i don't need him i got plenty of linebackers i don't need clay matthews i don't need another receiver i got good ass receivers already out there plastico barris and uh, marvin harrison jr lincoln kennedy that's the guy i'm probably gonna get pat tilly till that he's cool but i got ryan clark you know what i'm saying i also have um who else i got there as safety I forgot who else I got out there as safety, but it's Ron Clark, and it's another guy I got out there that's um, holding it down pretty good for me. So I don't really need him. And then if I'm not taking Night Train, I'm not taking no goddamn trash ass Troy Vincent. So Lincoln Kennedy, come on home, bruh. I used to have his old card, so we could go ahead and bring him back, okay? And you're gonna see, comparing him with um, Lane Johnson, you'll see that he's a way better card better in strength better at pass block better at pass block power better at finesse both the same run block better at run block power better at run block finesse so he's better in every single statistic bro okay and also the advantages with him is going to be what abilities okay so number one he is a raider which helps out my um theme team number two he gets a bunch of goddamn abilities for zero so he's going to be able to get um what we go put on him first um let's see we'll go ahead and throw nasty streak on him so number one the guy gets nasty streak that's an op ability he gets secure protector that's an op ability come over here i think i already have identifier somebody so guess what we'll put all day on him another good ability um i think that's all okay no nasty streaks over here as well hello we got edge protector we got post up so hello so we can throw post up on them too so post up for zero come on man hey hey come on bro that helps with the um that helps with the what's it called blocks the double team blocks and then over here i mean i can throw anything on them natural talent nasty streak we already got that lifeguard maybe like like that there, there's levels to this bro there's plenty of stuff we can do with this guy right here so maybe we already have somebody with linchpin so we don't really need multiple linchpins okay we already have somebody with linchpin so natural talent come on we'll throw that on them um you get something else bro lifeguard puller elite all day so might as well i mean i don't know when he might need puller elite but f it bro throw puller elite on his ass bro and then over here he gets one of these and usually in this last spot right here i usually like to go matador or maybe tough nut you know what i'm saying so i don't know bro like i don't know tough nut increase blocker resistant points or should we go prevent dominant bull rush moves with matador um huh hmm huh this is tough bro i usually like to go matador though I usually like to go Matador, bro. So we going Matador. F it. We go Matador, man. Um, you know what? Now nah, it may be better to go tough. You know, now nah, we'll keep Matador. But you guys see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's seven abilities we got on this dude right here, bro. Four zero AP. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I repeat, seven abilities for zero AP like come on man you get you, you can't get no better than that bro like he he has every ability that you may want on a lineman you know what i'm saying so guess what we about to put him in the lineup over this dude lane johnson it was good while lasted lane johnson bro like it was good but we got somebody better and with better abilities so we're making that goddamn upgrade right now and we go have the best right tackle in the goddamn game mr lincoln kennedy go ahead and throw him in there entire depth chart hold up we already got lincoln kennedy in the oh god damn it hold up bro where lincoln kennedy at 
Oh, he's giving us times two Raider right here. Ooh, that's tough, guys. That's tough right there. He's giving us times two Raiders right here, so we got to get rid of this. Ah, oh, man, we're going to be missing out on some Raiders, Kim, bro. Oh, that's tough. Hold up. Because we 37 out of 40 Raiders. Okay, okay, we cool. As long as we stay at 35 out of 40. So let's go ahead, remove him from the lineup. Um, actually, we're going to take everything off of him. Let's strip everything off of this dude. There we go. All right, we don't know. We no longer need you, bro. It is what it is. You know, hey, get your ass off the team, bro. So now we put Lincoln Kennedy right here in his spot, entire depth chart. And then now right here at right tackle, we're going to have to find us like another Raider or Seahawk to put right here. Um, if we have one in the lineup, then we should be able to go ahead and throw him in there. I don't think we have one just sitting in the binder anywhere. So we'll have to find out. Okay, we got this We got this bum right here. DeWan Jones, the rookie premier. He gets any um, any team Kim. So actually, we could throw him right there. And um, yeah, we'll just, we'll just keep him with Raiders, bro. We'll, we'll put Raiders on him. So that's why I'm glad I kept this dude around right here. So we put Raiders on him. Bam. We all gravy, baby. But you guys see. We got us another free 99 overall fan appreciation player. All of our alignment right now are 99 overall. I repeat, they all are 99, except for this goddamn guy right here. So we may have to upgrade this dude right here, bro. We may have to put the token on him just so we can make sure we got a 99 overall player um, at every position. Because Plastico, damn it, Plastico's a 90, 98. Damn, bro. So that's tough. So one of these guys is gonna eventually have to go when we want our 99 overall team, um, 99 overall team, because both of these dudes are 98s. So we gotta think about that right there. So let me know what you guys chose when it comes to y'all second free 99 overall fan appreciation player. If you guys got the same pack that I got, let me know. If you got something different, let me know. And guys, I also wanted to throw in there, guys, that um, I did out of nowhere just realize that you actually can get two, I repeat, two loyalty tokens. I forgot about this. So we got one loyalty token from the field pass right here at level nine. And then the second loyalty token is actually um, whenever you complete all of the challenge objectives over here. Um, this one right here, the daily ones, you get another loyalty token right here for completing all 14 daily objectives. So there's one daily, um, one loyalty token right here for the daily objectives. And then there's another one right here at level nine. So you should be able to have two fan appreciation loyalty tokens to upgrade your players to 99. Like I said, bro, I completely did not even recognize that until I went to make Plastico Burris a 99 overall. And then I noticed once I clicked on it, I had two sitting in here. I was like, whoa. So now I can put one on him. And then I can also put one on um this dude right here, Joe Thomas. So I just want to throw that in here um before I ended the video, man. Um, I, I just found that out right before I was about to actually end the video. So now we got both of these dudes to a 99. The reason why I didn't put it on Ryan Clark, because Ryan Clark is actually Kim to a 99 already. So that's pretty cool. And we can give this dude times three of somebody. So let's give him times three Raiders, bro. Times two Seahawks. So that's cool. That's gravy, baby. So, hey, I just want to make sure y'all knew that. But until next time, it's been your boy. Y'all stay blessed. Bees and stay breezy, man.